What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so before we start anything, you guys probably already heard. You've already seen it. And, uh, well, I'm just here to just let you guys know that, hey, this is our first ever episode in what used to be our Draven XE711 channel, now rebranded as our new Gym Leader Draven channel. And if you guys don't know what happened, well, there's going to be a video at the end, but I'm going to explain it right here, too. Yes, some a-holes decided to, I don't know, play a prank on me, hack my Gym Leader Draven channel, delete it. So I had to redo everything, and I mean everything. Everything. I had to upload everything to what used to be my Draven XC711 channel, to this channel right here, and, or, I said it twice, but you guys get what I'm trying to say. And so, now we're going to continue on with our adventure right here, now that everything's been made sense, or, I don't know. Whatever, I'm, I'm just going to stop babbling. Let's go. So here we are in the ice path. And uh, if you guys don't recall, in the last episode, we just defeated a whole bunch of trainers. Got messy a few levels here and there. And now, right here in the ice path, we're going to be exploring a few places where, you know, we've all seen. It's all icy. As you can see, I'm just like sliding left and right. Because I like the ice. I don't know. Also, you'll be able to find some cool Pokemon right here, like Jinx. Um, Dillabird, these guys, Zubat, you know, those Pokemon that, you know, we, we normally see in caves, and, uh, I'm gonna just get away from you because I don't want to talk to you. What else? Oh yeah, you can also find Swinubs in here too. That's if you want those kinds of Pokemon. Um, it's actually a very, very, uh, fitting place to go to before you get to the last gym because, of course, the last gym is a Dragon-type gym. You don't want to mess with that. You really don't. And I don't want to mess with you, Golbat. And uh, since I've already blurted out what kind of Pokemon are in here, I'm just going to use this because I really don't want to battle anybody or any Pokemon. Got to stay prepared. Got those super potions. Or super repels, I should say. All right, so let's move on right here. As you already know, there's going to be a few ice paths right here. And you're going to know that we're going to be, uh, you know, challenged with a few, a, few, uh, a few tricks here and there. As you can see, I'm going to try my best to figure this all out. It's been a while since I've played it, and <laughs> would you look at that. Finally got there. Okay. And I do believe you can get an HM right here. I could be wrong, though. Grab this. And yes, I was right. You can grab the HM07. And that, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's the HM07 uh, waterfall. Could be wrong. I don't know. Let me check. I'm checking. Yes, it's waterfall. Okay, so we got all the HMs, and... Now it's time to move on right here, and, uh, okay. Gotta remember what to do right here. Oh, yes, right here, and, uh, right here, right here, right here, right here. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it, the one place I couldn't figure out. Uh, okay. Pretty sure many of you guys are yelling at me right now. Go there! Right there. Okay, so we figured it out. Oh, and the repels wore it off. Huh, I didn't even know that uh, sliding takes takes away of, uh, it counts as steps, I don't know. I'm just sliding, it's not really steps, I don't know. And uh, are there trainers here? Not really. You just have to go through this whole area and figure out a few places. Um, also, make sure to have a Pokemon that no strength because you will be, uh, you will need a Pokemon that needs strength to move these boulders around into these, uh, well, these craters right here. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. We're going to figure this whole thing out. No, you cannot. You cannot get out of here without a Pokemon without strength. And uh, oh, we go up here. Leave that there. Move this around, and I'm gonna get a lay of the land right here. Huh. Okay, so I have to bring it up top right here. All right, let's move this boulder right here. Alrighty. Okay, so boulder number one right here is already taken care of, and. There we go. That's one down. So many more to go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and figure this out right here. Where are ya? There's another boulder right here. Oh yes, I have. To, ooh, wow. I have to. Yeah, that will not work. I'm pretty sure I have to push this one up right here. And okay. That's right. I'm getting it. I'm finally getting it. All right. Pushing it through. And. Here, one right there, and right here. 
So that's two boulders down. And, well, oh, I shouldn't have done that. But you guys see what I'm trying to tell you? You will be able to go into the next floor right here. And, uh, of course, you need those boulders to actually, uh, to actually dictate where you're going to be going right here. And, uh, well, there's one right there. I don't know if there's an item right here. There could be an item. Yes. A carbos. A hidden carbos. And, uh, let's see if we can find, oh, the, well, the effect went off. And, uh, let's see. You could always go over there. You can always go, yes, you do need the boulders to actually get to that one particular area right down the middle. But, unfortunately, we're going to get attacked by a killer gold bats right here because, you know, gold bats are attracted to us in some weird, creepy way. And I'm going to escape because I don't need... I don't need this kind of trouble and you know what that's the reason why we bought uh, super repels but you know what? I have a max repel right here let's go ahead and use that first alrighty alrighty let's get back to the floor right here and finish this one off I was gonna well I was gonna finish this in one fell swoop but of course I'm a little trigger happy and yes we're gonna have to start all over with this one yeah we're gonna have to start all over okay Push this one aside. Alrighty. Push this one up to the top, and we're gonna leave. We're gonna leave that right there. Okay, where to go to next? Let's see. Up top, left, right, and we're gonna get to that boulder later on. And do not fall in that hole again. And uh, okay, push this to the side. And down to the bottom, and that's another boulder down. And we still got one more boulder to go. I'm pretty sure that's the most important boulder that we need to get to. Alrighty. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. I figured it out. Push to this side. Push it down side. And there's an area right there where you can actually fit through. Moving into this side. One more step to the bottom, and everything is okay. And there we go. Alrighty, okay, so that's taken care of, and there's that boulder that we need. And now we're gonna have to find our way around this area, since I already got the items. Ooh, one boulder short, and right here. There, and okay, where to go to? I'm gonna go up top, yes! And the, huh! I guess sliding does take away your... Wow, well, it does count as uh, walking, which is annoying. It is very annoying. And there's a full heal. You know, we all need that full heal. And here's the last floor. Now, if you do have a Pokemon that knows a uh, Rock Smash, that's a good way to go to. I believe there's a... That's a, that's a much needed item that you guys need. And here we have the Elusive Swine Nub. Mm-hmm. Now, you can use this Pokemon against Claire. She is a very good Pokemon to have, or this, yeah, it is a she. It is a very good Pokemon to have to take on Claire, but it is slower than her Pokemon. So just be aware of that. And we're going to take away this Super Repel right here. I don't think we need to slide anywhere else. And I'm going to go up top. And let's grab this item right here. And would you look at that, the Never Melt Ice actually works for uh, any kind of ice type moves. And like it says, it never melts. And I think this is the last part right here. Probably. Ooh. Okay, I was wrong. I was wrong. Okay. Need to get through this whole area right here. Or I could be right. Yeah, this is the last part, I think. I don't know. Oh! Did not mean to do that. Alright, let's go back down. Alright. Let's see. Right here? Right here. Okay. Okay. Well, at least we got this item, the TM44. And I need to figure out what I need to figure out what item this is. TM44. Oh, it's rest. It's a good move. Good healing. Good healing move and uh, we need to get to that right there. That is Oh wow, we need to slide we need to slide through. Okay, I get you. Go up top, go into the side, going down and there we go. Alrighty. Huh. Did I mess up? No. I feel like I messed up. No, nope. no, I wasn't trying to re or boot this whole thing. All right, let's go ahead and uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, repel. 
It's a lot of repels that I'm using right now. And right here, down here. Oh, okay. I see what I I see what I was doing. This is for the item right here, and we found ourselves an iron. Good. Uh, it's a good. Uh, you know, vitamin to give to your Pokemon. And we need to figure our way out right here. And there we go. Alrighty. Please let this be the last one. No. Oh yeah, it is. It is. Grab this, and that's a protein. I might as well give those a. Uh, I might, have, might as well give these vitamins to somebody. Who should I give it to, though? Carbos. Who, Carbos is for something, somebody fast. Who's slow right here? Relic, you're not slow. Nessie. That's right, you're slow. Iron. We got the Iron right here. And who's weak on the defensive part? Relic. That's right. And, okay, we got a protein right here. This is for, what, attack? Physical attack? It is a physical attack. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, I'm trying to press that button right here. Protein right here. And who is weak on the uh, physically attacking portion? Let's go with Nessie. Nessie right here. Alrighty. I think we're done. Going down right here. And ooh, there's one more item that we need to get. Right here. And we got the PP up to Pokemon Viagra. That's right. I said it. Sue me. And home sweet home. Look at that. We finally made it out of the uh, ice path right here. We're into Blackthorn City now. Talk to this girl. She's like, wow, you came through the ice path? You must be a real, a real hotshot trainer. Well, yes, I am. And I guess that's pretty much it, right? Is it? It is. It is. So here it is, guys. Blackthorn City. Pretty good town. The last town for, or city for a Pokemon badge. So stay tuned. In the next episode, we will be taking a small tour and maybe battling a few trainers here and there. So thank you guys for watching. I'll be back in just another, or for another episode of Pokemon Crystal right here. See you guys.